Welcome back to Trailer Park Cooking. I'm Jeannie B. Delicious, and today I'm visiting a friend's house and I'm showing them how to season pans. But first I want to say thank you to a wonderful subscriber. George, you sent me three pans, three sets of pans. My daughter didn't have any pans, so I gave one set to her. And then we are seizing the cast iron pans that you sent me. Uh, but first I need to get started with this show in a different way. All right, so the things you're going to need is cast iron skillets that have not been seasoned, flaxseed oil that's organic. You can buy the oil. This is a oil that you can consume um, and it helps different ailments and stuff, but it's great for putting on cast iron skillet pans. You can find this in the organic section. So flax oil. So we have a little egg pan here and we're just going to heat it up on the burner. I'm going to put it on like not terrible high, but medium high. Yeah! So there's the pan. So once the pan is nice and heated, you're just going to take a cap full of this and put it inside the pan. You're going to turn your oven on to about 250 and bake it for two hours. <laughs> Alright, so we're back. Our pan is heated. And the first thing we need is a little drink. All right, we got this flaxseed oil here. And this is a pretty viscous oil. It looks like olive oil, but we're gonna stick it in this pan. This pan's super hot right now. Um, and I need some napkins. Thank goodness we went to Taco Bell today. We got some napkins in the container. And so you've got the oil in there. You just take it off and set it aside. And then you're going to heat up your next pan and do the same thing. Mm. All right, so we're heating our next pan. This one's cooling off and the oil's cooking into the porous surface of these cast iron skillets. So let me get a shot of that. It has an unusual scent to it, kind of like, I don't know, it kind of smells like old fry grease. So we have that, and we just want to pick up that baby pan and get it nice and coated on the sides. And just let it cool with that oil in it. So while this pan is cooling, we've got this pan heating. So it has to be pretty hot. So we're gonna turn the stove off. That way if we have a fire. So you want enough oil to cover the bottom of the pan. And again, we're just round it on those things, all those spaces. Take our next pan, heat it up. Hopefully I don't catch myself on fire. <clears throat> Yay! Okay, this is the patient weight game. Okay. So we have our flaxseed oil a safe distance away from the stove. I don't know why, but we keep the oil away from the stove for some reason. And this, we don't have hot pads, so in my family we just use our clothing. Um, so yeah, so see how that looks? Looks nice. There's not a lot of oil in there. I'm just going to do that with the rest of the cool pans. Right, we've got some more Taco Bell napkins. We might have to go and still more Taco Bell napkins later. So I'm just trying to sop up some of the excess because when you tip them upside down, it's going to drip to the bottom of the oven. And then once it cools again, we just wait. So I'm just gonna leave this one right side up, I think. And I'll stick it in the oven like that. I'll just leave them all right side up. So it's that because I can't find anything to put on the bottom of the oven to prevent a fire. So we're just gonna keep them right side up and that'll work too. 
I don't know why we do it the other way, but if you know, you can leave a comment down below. Okay, now two hours. So it's been like two hours. We're gonna take the hot pans out of the oven. They've been on 250 degrees for two hours. And so we're just gonna take this hot pad, take the pans out individually. You can see on this one, it's looking nice and shiny. And then on these ones, I don't have as much oil. It's so yummy, nicely coated. Now you can do this a couple times and then you'll have good cast iron, seasoned cast iron skillets. Turn my camera off. So thanks for joining me for another great show on Genie B for seasoning the pens. Join me next time on oh yeah that's right trailer park cooking i'm genie b delicious bye y'all